Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I wanted to talk to you guys about a really, really quick um, weekend or, you know, running out to the store kind of day where you don't want to do full on makeup, but you kind of want to do a little bit something. And I also want to show the technique that I use for making like an ombre look or mixing my vial colors. So first of all, I already did this, but I've used the bronzing stick. This is still available, but it is discontinued, so it's available while supplies last. Um, and I just, when I do mine, I just line on either side of my nose. I line around my forehead. I line right here to kind of shade under here, um, and then I blend it in. Um, and then I also applied a little bit to my eyelids. Um, especially concentrating on the outer corner and then I used our highlighter stick get lit this is also on the retirement list um, and I just kind of highlighted my forehead my brow bone the inner corner of my eye as well as my eyelid right here to get a little bit of that shine and then my nose um, so the highlight points oh and I also did right there so um, that's what I already did for a very quick look. So now I want to show how I mix my vial colors. I've had a lot of uh, requests to show this because I've been posting a lot of this in my VIP group. So as a reminder, vial comes with a two part system. So the first part is the primer. So you're going to want to use a very, very small amount. So I pretty much dab off the wand. You want this to get like a tacky sheen. So I'm going to look down at my mirror and apply. making sure you get the inner corners as well. Now, while this is drying, and I talked about this in my last video, you want it to make, get a tacky sheen. So while this applies, this is, or while this dries, this is when I do my mascara. So sorry, I'm looking down, but. So I do my mascara while my vial is drying. Hey, that rhymed. <laughs> um, so, very quick application of my mascara. I already can feel that the vial is getting a little bit tacky, so that's good. It means we are ready for business. So I feel that it's tacky. I'm gonna use two colors that on their own are not ideal for me. Um, I do like the darker one on its own, but I'm using the um, Beyond the Pale as my base color, and then I'm using the Mocha Me to line it, and I will smoosh my lips, that's my technical term <laughs> for it. So like all the vial, you're gonna wanna use just a little bit. So I wipe the excess off and I apply all over. As you can see, this color is so pale that it makes my lips disappear. I don't really like it on its own because of that, um, and it's because of my skin complexion. It just doesn't go well with it. So what I want to do is then line the outer lip with the Mocha Me, and then I'm going to smoosh my lips together. That's what I call it, smooshing. So I'm going to line it. Doesn't matter if you're precise because you're going to smoosh them together. All right, now that it's lined, you can see that it's lined. I'm going to smoosh them together. Literally just rubbing them together. What this is gonna do is cause it to have like a ombre look. where the inside of my lips are gonna be lighter and the outside of the lips are darker. If you want less ombre, you could actually just kind of um, put more of the darker color on the inside. But I like the ombre look. It's unique and these are very easy to mix. So you can see it took a not so flattering shade and I mix them together. I do this with a lot of colors. If I want to have um, red but not so in my face red, I might line um, with a darker color but use stop blushing on the inside. So I've done it with you slay me as a liner, love the wine you're with. Stop blushing is a great base color so I do that a lot. So as you can see, it made a color that was not so flattering, a nice mix, 
All I'm going to do now is blot my lips, not eat or drink for 10 minutes, and I'm going to have this long wear lasting color. So I hope this was a great tutorial for you on how you can use my smoosh method to get an ombre color or just to mix your colors. All right. Thanks for tuning in. Have a great day.